Yes, it's three simple numbers to remember that could save your life. This month marks the one-year anniversary of the 988 National Suicide Hotline. Now, since then, the hotline has helped assist thousands through their mental health struggles and saved lives nationwide. While Ohio leaders explain just how beneficial this hotline has become, local mental health advocates broke down the data they're seeing right here in the Mahoning Valley. When it seems like there's nowhere else to turn, the 988 National Suicide Hotline could be the life-saving tool used by thousands since its inception last July. This comes as Ohio Governor Mike DeWine says his administration is working to strengthen and expand Ohio's crisis care system. What can we do to make sure that we've given them the tools and thought through uh, what to do to keep themselves safe in this moment, but then also in the future. An average of 8,700 people in Ohio in need of help called the hotline every month. When a caller dials 988, they're offered support and connection to local resources. But what's happening here in the Mahoning Valley? So far this year in Mahoning County alone, 18 people have died by suicide. Last year, the number was at 44 deaths. On average, every month, about 150 callers from Mahoning County alone dial the hotline for help. In Trumbull County, the trend is similar. So far this year, they've had 11 suicides in the county. Last year, 26. They've also seen an uptick in children attempting the act. Over 400 hotline workers with a wide variety of backgrounds have been trained on how to take the calls. And so call training that we provide really goes through the entire spectrum of what those problems and, and scenarios may be. Um, because you never know as a call taker what you're going to be answering when you pick up the phone in efforts to save as many lives as it can. Now this comes as Governor DeWine and the Ohio legislator is providing $46 million in funding to sustain mental health operations for the next two years.